so uh, we hear you might be going to 105 again. Ah, that's what they, they're talking about. I really don't care which way, 105, 108, 112. Uh, I just want to fight. Uh, 108, we're trying to unify title with the champions, not 105 with me. So if they ask me to go to 105 just to have a good fight with uh, one of the champs, I go down, do that fight, and they go back up to my way to 108 and stay with my title. And if not, go up to 112, but I want to fight Omar Le Baton Alvarez. That uh -huh. is one of the good fight. I believe it's a good fight for, for both of us. 15 defense, me got 15 defense. He's a super champion his way. I'm a super champion my way. I yeah. think that's a good fight for both of us. Uh huh. Is it important to you to to get titles in a lot of different divisions? A lot of fighters like to get the three divisions. And I believe in uh, not to stay with but all of them all the time, you know, just to take all the champ, you know, all the titles in a moment and then decide well, which title I want to stay with and get back both of them. And just like they're doing now, they, they put you like the super champ in that weight and go back to stay with the with the title that you want to really want to stay because if you know you're not really going to win a lot of money because you got to pay something to all them titles so yeah. that's not a business to all fighters you've been such a great champion you hardly lose any rounds and you've been champion for a long time how much longer do you think you can go i believe i don't know new kids are coming up and right now i'm 33 uh, i believe not that nah, not my age is gonna make me retire I believe in my body, the the energy that I still feel about boxing. That's when I decided to quit. But right now, I still got the spirit. I still got the the energy to keep on like a champ. I feel like I'm 30. I'm like 26 years old, 27. And for right now, I'm not thinking to retire. Have you changed your style at all? As uh, have you? Do you feel that you're getting slower, or you're, you've adjusted as you've gotten older? Nah, not really. Uh, sometimes I feel like I'm getting more stronger. Yeah. Uh, and like I told you. still like, the fastest, fastest yeah, thing around, uh, right? <laughs> I, I used to be more faster than 105 pounds, uh, more, you know, more light. But when I was like, when I started my, my career, I was so different fighting than I'm right now. I used to be a, more a puncher. Uh -huh. I used to like to be body to body. But when I got my first cut, I decided to change my style. I say I'm a boxer. Why well, I don't gotta be fighting like this? That's why I decided to be more a boxer than a fighter. What's your toughest fight you've had? I always say it's Michael Leva, and just because he hit me with a good body shot in the fifth round, and I thought I was gonna fight, I was gonna lose the fight because I was just just waiting for the third the sound because I couldn't hold the pressure that he was putting me, and when I sat down on my corner. I just decided to change my, my, my style of fighting and fighting, get hit and don't get hit. And that's when I started getting back my fight and, and won the fight. In all your great career, all the great fights you've had, what do you consider your most satisfying win? I think it was with, with Nelson Dieba for me uh -huh. because I like the way I fought. I looked at real strong in that way, in that, in that fight. I, I, I show a lot of people that I'm a, I got power in my hand too because I put them like two times bad. And for for the people and for me, my longest fight, my 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 fight that put me a little bit more up in my career was Uo Cassidy uh -huh. because a lot of people that knows about boxing thought I was gonna lose. Yeah, he'd win that, yeah. And just beat because him twice. His, just because his height, just because the weight, just because he's aggressive, because he beat two Puerto Ricans good ex champions and I tell a lot of people it's the styles that make the boxing and my style I know he's gonna have a little bit of problem and I and I show a lot of people that yeah Tw 112 is that the absolute maximum or are you thinking you'll go even higher no uh, I believe 112 for me yeah I think right now like a 124 I maybe could go to 115 you never know yeah uh, but when I look back and I and I heard that I didn't knew uh, Pacquiao was 108 pounds when he turned pro, uh -huh. and he's fighting 147 pounds. Yeah. So, well, you don't know what could happen in this. Maybe you'll get Ox Oscar next. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, g congratulations and Thanks. good luck, and and uh, if you go back down to 105, that'd be interesting because a lot of fighters don't go back down; they just keep going up yeah, and up and up. Just keep on going up, but 
I, I go back down, but you know I'm going back up. And, yeah. Yeah, but if I go back down and I and I and I win the champion, and there's a lot of challenge, there, I stay there. But yeah. now I go back up to one away and maintain me one away because it's three pounds, three pounds, or three pounds. Yeah, sure. It's sure. real hard to go down a little bit, three pounds more. All right, thanks. Okay, great. Thanks very much. Good luck. He's like Mama Manuel. Yeah. Juanma? Yeah. Juanma? Yeah. Is he here yet? Nah, he haven't.